Oh, cool. It's a trailer train. And I can already tell it's got an old war bonnet on it. A what? An old war bonnet locomotive. What's that? You'll see in just a minute. So. Look at the, oh, oh, he stopped. It was like there was another guy. 8331, 4916, 7594, and BNSF Old War Bonnet 4703. That's the old war bonnet right there. Yeah, I thought that guy was going to go across, but he decided not, not to. That's interesting. I've never seen a trailer inside a well car like that. That's how they're hauling my brother's trailer. Oh, yeah. To Hawaii. Uh-huh. That yeah. could be one of his trailers. You never know, huh? Possibly. Mm -hmm. Well, no, it'd probably be going the other direction. It'd probably be going uh, eastbound through here because unless he's unless they're taking it to Stockton or San Francisco. They're probably going to because they're um, taking it to Maui. Yeah, but because um, uh, they could take it to that port or they could take it to the port of Long Beach. Pacific train down there too. <laughs> Actually, I don't know where we can. Um, we could probably catch that Union Pacific train, but we'd have to go. We'd have to go like pretty far east. But I don't know if we'd want to go all the way out to Highway 184. Yeah. Just catch what we're what we're yeah. catching now. Yeah. Yeah, that sounds I good to me. I think that that's one of those ones that he has. Yeah, probably. That was a house. pretty short UP training over there. Because it's already gone. <laughs> it might have been an SJVR. Mm. It should. Um... This one right here is a BNSF train.
This is a pretty long train. Yeah, I think that's they'll stop for their crew change. Up there at the yard, anyway. So we might be... I think the end of it's coming up, so you know, maybe we'll be close enough. Uh, that maybe it'll be far enough that it'll... it'll oh, nope. It's going to stop right now. Oh, man. Oh. Get this guy. Oh yeah, that's just crazy right there. Wow. I mean, look at that. Two guys just hopping over the train illegally. Wow. Actually, make it three. Gee whiz. Oh. Psh, holy cow. That's stupid. Right stupid. Here. Yeah. Dumb, I should say. Sorry, but my apology. I mean, if that train had moved, that guy would be dead right now. Mm -hmm. I mean, I mean, and they're one block away from. They could have gone down to Truxton, too. Which is one block away from here. One and a half blocks away, whatever it is. Or two blocks. Instead of... Stupid right stupid, here. Stupid, yeah. Dumb, I should say. Sorry, but my apology. I mean... Oh, yeah, he was. Yeah, I see, I mean, people... There's, there's another UP train over there. Huh, interesting. But... Another Union Pacific train over there. Over where? It's going uh, westbound over there on the other crossing. Oh. Oh, this one's almost done. We could probably catch it if we went over to 30, uh, or if we went over to like, maybe over to Olive Drive. I don't know. We might, it's stopping now, but it's going to be stopped for a minute. We could probably even go over to 30th and M or Q Street even. Get to it probably, depending on what he does. Yeah, oh, okay, he's going that, still going that way now, it looks like. Oh, nope, he's back the other way now. He's going eastbound. That might be the UP yard switcher, perhaps. I don't know. Over there. I've never seen both of these crossings block, blocked by a train at the same time. So, I thought that was kind of interesting. And this guy's just crazy right here. You don't know if another train's coming or not. You should always wait until the gates go back up. 